I think the other thing that pharmaceutical companies don't tell you is that the range of that weight loss that they measured is not over six months. It's over a year to 72 months. So, I mean, 72 weeks. So it's a year, year and a half. So if you're losing 10% of your weight, say you're 200 pounds and you lose 20 pounds, that's 20 pounds over about a year or a little over a year. Or uh, depending on which medication, it's like a year and a half. So it's not as dramatic as you think it is. Mm -hmm. And so I think people kind of rushed into this thinking, oh, I just need it to lose weight. I just need my appetite suppressed without really thinking like, oh, I actually need to go on a diet. I need to learn how to eat right. I actually need to exercise mm -hmm. because there's a lot of studies out there right now that are showing that a lot of the weight loss that you lose with these medications is actually muscle wasting, 20% muscle wasting. So if you're not lifting weights, you're basically losing your muscle and not just your fat. So, and why is that important? It's important because one, muscle is metabolically active. It's actually burns fat while you're sitting. Mm -hmm. Number two, it's what gives you your longevity, your strength, your everyday moves. And so if you're losing your muscle, basically you're losing your energy. You're losing your mass. You're losing your ability to, to function. So...